what was it like to join this ensemble? I mean, it's ridiculous. It's, you know, 10 year old me is freaking out all the time on this. And it's, it's insanely lucky. And I'm, I'm, I'm super honored. It's a pretty rarefied air to be on a show that's been around for 100 episodes, five years, especially these days. Um, and, you know, that, 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 that scene is like in the, in the vibe on set, through the cast, through the band response, it's, really, uh, it's a really real special world. So, it, I, I feel very lucky to be a part of it. Was it easier to join the team or the family with a bunch of others joining at the same time? Absolutely. I, I think we've had, you know, we've gotten to sort of, it's like, it's like starting in high school, you know, you're kind of nervous, but you know everyone else is also kind of nervous. Um, and it made us really cling to each other and form a bond quite immediately and, and, and uh, very authentic. And so we've all become very close as we all try and navigate this sort of narrow world that, that we're all thrust into. Uh, so it's been it's been cool to start with a bunch of people and you know Rick and, and Madison uh, and Emily and, and Echo and everyone and you know Stephen everyone is so lovely and welcoming and, and, and hardworking and it's, it's very cool. And the new recruits all have their own story going on in this crossover. Can you say anything about that? I can say that we're all working together um, to help with this uh, invasion. Um, doing what we can. Um, especially when there's Supergirl and Flash to do uh, more of the heavy lifting, probably. Um, but we all, uh, I will say that we all have different reactions to the other superheroes coming in. And filming up here in Vancouver, are you happy to be the character who wears the most clothing? Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't super happy in July. I'm getting more and more happy every day. I was saying the other day, I can't really tell when it's raining when I'm in the rag, so it's, uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's a, that, that costume is becoming, well, at first I was like, it's pretty hot, pretty tight, pretty, uh, you know, oppressive in a good way. Um, but now it's like, yeah, it's like wearing a balaclava and a winter jacket all the time. It's great. And are we going to see more exploration onto his feelings about what happened in Haven Rock? And Absolutely. In fact, we'll, we'll, I believe we'll get to it in the next episode. Uh, I won't say how he reacts, you know, but I think it's interesting that, that she sort of tells him what her part of uh, what has happened, and he sort of walks away. I think Rory's very, uh, very thoughtful, and very introspective, uh, and he and thinks way on him, uh, and he doesn't take him lightly. And so I think he'll he'll go and he'll process this, and how he reacts is very interesting. And is it possible we may see a flashback episode for him at some point? Well, uh, Honestly, I don't know. That's a, that's a good idea. Uh, uh, maybe we both pitch that. Uh, yeah, that would be that would actually be really cool. I don't really think about that. Uh, it's not in the works as of right now, but it's certainly there's certainly um, there's certainly mileage in going and seeing you know what he was like with his family, what you know how he changed. Um, that I, I think he I think it really obviously changed his whole world. Uh, and. Um, how excited are you to be here for Arrow 100 episodes? I mean, it, it feels like I'm pinch hitting in the World Series. It's like I, mean, I have very little to do with getting it here, but it's nice to hear the to hear the hear the crowd roar. You know, it's uh, it's very cool. And, you know, like I was saying, like just to be a it's a very lucky job when you get to work as an actor at all, um, and then when you get to do something like this that that um, everyone, both in front of and behind the camera. Uh, really appreciates in fans like it's it's just so rare um, and it's what we do you know we don't do it to do it in a vacuum you know I want people to feel the way I felt when I saw the first Batman movie or Back to the Future or you know you know knowing that so many other people are watching enjoying it brings people together and so it's a cool thing to be a and has anyone bought you any Ragman comics since you got the role I bought myself Ragman oh, nice um, I haven't opened them because they're quite beautiful and they're very hard to find um, so I ordered them on Amazon so I have them in my in my home in LA but I uh, but I cherish them they're very they're very beautiful well congrats